This the prize right here. Check this out. I'm not telling y'all what y'all can do, what y'all can say. Hell, I don't even care. But stop playing victim to being sexually assaulted, to being molested when you're around here giving praises and props to a nigga that says he's coming for kids. Because that let me know you didn't get raped. You was willingly fucking at the age of six and seven. Okay? Okay? That let me know you wasn't abused. You was the abuser at that age. You came out fucking and sucking on dick. Or you lying about the whole story. Because as a person that been molested before... I have no sympathy for now niggas like that. None. That's why I don't like the nigga. That's why I can say what I mean and mean what I say. See, when y'all make up all these lies, oh, I got raped, and oh, I got molested, and then months later y'all praising a nigga that did it to another child, get the fuck up out of here. I sat there the other night and watched Sean Bradley allow goddess and seven stars go at it while he laughed at them whores like a dog. He laughed at them ducks like a dog. Okay? But yet this morning, when I wake up and scroll through the YouTube screen, I see seven stars lies. Seven stars is praising a man that molests his kids. Seven stars. Is it a lie that you got molested as a kid? Or was you willingly fucking at the age of six and seven for you to be giving shots out to a sex predator? This man clearly said on Nefertarian stage that he went after Rita Churin and drug her through these streets and he looking for more children. That sounds like a pedophile. Okay? See, when females don't like, or males don't like somebody, they'd rather ride with that son, with somebody else than to face the fight. Okay, you sitting up there hollering about Sean Bradley. She talk about Sean Bradley. Bitch, you need to be talking about Sean Bradley too, bitch. Stop hating on the lady. She, she could talk about, if you make the news, goddammit, if Sean Bradley make the news every day, she supposed to talk about him every day. That's why she's the news lady. Stop motherfucking sucking dick and get off your bad body, hump body ass, and motherfucker get to grind on. Ain't nobody gonna give you shit. Seven stars, you came from Wiley. Wiley brought you on these scenes. Tasha K did not bring you on these scenes. When Tasha K discovered who you was and what was you about and that you came from Wiley, Tasha K don't even want to be fucked up with your ass. If you can't go home to your own family members, that means nobody in your family likes you. And nobody else going to take you in. That's why you sleep in that church. Get your priorities right. Go the fuck off on Sean Bradley. Go the fuck off on Rick Reed. Go the fuck off on the men that dogged you in your life. Okay? And stop fucking hating. Being a hater all your fucking life. Maybe you'll come up. Wiley brought you on here. Right now, you looking like Wiley Seven Stars. The person that brought you on here. You got the new people thinking Tasha K brought you on here. Tasha K tried to help you because she seen a lost individual she thought that she could help. When Tasha K seen you was full of bullshit and you Wiley... Team, you came from Wally. Tasha K blowed it out on you. Talk about all that tricking you doing online, Seven Stars. Tricking. See, your cousin Maurice said that you was a prostitute. And you tricked. You came on and said, no, no. I, I, I just was at the call center taking calls for the prostitute. But guess what you do a couple of weeks ago? You try to start up an escort service right here. You was the whore. 
Stop fucking being a bag of lies, seven stars. And get your hustle on. One.